We're going to Vegas, mate. We're mate, going. Are you serious? You better not be winding me up. Big time. Yes. Big time. What happens so in yes. Vegas? This day is stays stays in, in Vegas. Vegas. Come Baby. on, boys. This is our stag do, but it's going to be research to see course, what we can do and bring Vegas back to Norfolk so we can have Vegas. a Vegas wedding here. Like for us to go in Vegas yeah. is obviously awesome. Like best yeah. thing we can do. Bu bucket list tick. What is Anna gonna do when she finds out you went Vegas with with the money for the wedding? I've always said to her, the only way I'd marry her if it was in Vegas and I was drunk and it was Elvis. You know, it's, like, it's gonna take a bit of the budget. Most of the budget. <laughs> <laughs> It's research. <laughs> so it's going to turn our wedding into that bit more authentic. Basically trying to create that in wood, isn't it? So yeah. We'll see where we go with it, I reckon. The question being, is Anna going to like a shed that I'm going to end up building? My answer, very, very doubtful, but we will wait and see. I'll do my best, slap a little bit of white paint on, we'll be all right. Slap a little bit of white paint on and you'll be all right? It's the third week of planning. Dodgy deals in an envelope. And having spent one week and a quarter of his budget on a stag in Vegas, Lee's keen to get a bargain on the wedding ring. This is going to be a first. I've never met anyone um, off Gumtree to buy rings. It's a little bit bizarre. <laughs> Nice to meet you. All right. Yeah, not too bad, thank you. Ta da. They look even better in person than they do yeah. in the pictures. Yeah, they're nice. The missus just didn't like them, so you had to buy some more. Is that how it goes down? Pretty much. Yeah. yeah. There we go. Thank you very much. Deal done. For £1,200, Lee's got a wedding band and an engagement ring. There's only one thing left to do pop the question. Right, because obviously I haven't asked her to marry me yet. So I don't know how we're going to work this. I guess we just write on the back, because it's going to be the proposal and the invite to the wedding. Be ready to leave at 13.30 on the 8th of the 4th of 18. So use the Queen of Diamonds. Is will you marry me a question? Well, you I'm, telling her? it's not really a question, because we know the answer, don't we? That's... No, we don't. There we go. There you go. Right. That's good. It's not too bad. I'm happy with that. Back at home, Anna is about to get her dream proposal. You have to pull that straight because I can't cope with that one. With a ring bought at a bus stop, left on her doorstep in a shoebox. <laughs> is that the door? Yeah. Oh my God, look. My God. Be ready to leave at half past one on the 8th of the 4th. Hashtag umbrella, will you marry me? Because <gasps> you're the queen, he's the oh king. Oh, my God! <laughs> oh, my God! I am now slightly concerned about what Lee is going to have me doing. It's time for the bridesmaids and guests to get their first taste of Lee's big plan. A little shed, um, chapel. A little chapel for little Lee. King is alive. Six sealed himself, definitely. Five minutes. In a longer five, five minutes, minutes your, your life. It really is. Five more minutes. Oh my God! Is that some sort of chapel thing? Thank you very much, gentlemen. Oh my God! Hello, baby. It's not quite the chapel I was expecting. Baby, it's good. It is like a cross between our home and Vegas. I think you clearly have always wanted to marry me. No. 